Hi everybody, so today I'm going to show you something that I ordered, not ordered, but actually I purchased off the Facebook Marketplace. It was my first time doing that and it went pretty smooth, so, um, which is a good sign because, you know, I might purchase more stuff from there. So I've been eyeballing for the last two months um, something that... I just didn't want to dive into just like right away. I really had to think about it. And then when the opportunity came for me to get it at a really good price, I went ahead and made the decision to go ahead and get it. So what I purchased was the Zutter Bind It All. Now this is a discontinued um, product. I believe this came out probably 10 years ago because when I look on um, YouTube, at videos about this product. Some of them were dated literally 10 years ago. So um, what this is, if you've never heard of it, it's a binding system, or um, similar to the cinch, like the one that's made um, by Howdy Swap. Um, but this one is a lot more portable. So this thing came with the case, which is part of the reason why I bought it. Um, well, this particular one, because I wanted to be able to store this. So it's a really good case with a lot of pockets, but I'll show you that in a bit. Right now, let me show you the actual system. So here is some wire, okay? And this is what it looks like, okay? So as you can see, it's pretty small. Now I was thinking, oh, this is gonna be really heavy when I got it, because I mean, I've seen um, the cinch like over at Hobby Lobby and that thing is massive and it looks like it would be heavy because it can punch a whole bunch of coils. But this one actually was not as heavy as I thought it was gonna be. So um, the way that it works is that you would, um, well, you can pull this extra foot out you need it to actually I probably need to glue that down let me see if I can get it to come out so you can get some leverage and then you would put um, the paper in here and then you would I don't want to because that's a CD and then you would pull this down and it would cut these square holes in there now I chose the bind it system I mean the zutter system over the cinch because the cinch does circles versus this one does the um, rectangulars. Rectangles, yeah, these are rectangles, they're not squares. And I found that probably with the coils, it's going to work out better that way. So, um, plus I chose it also for the portability. So you've got, that's where you punch it and then you would place the, the stuff in here, okay? And then that's also where you would press the, um, for the coils to be, you know, to close. So you've got also some, um, you've got right here where it would say open, continuous, do the cover and the inner pages. Now it came with a um, instructional CD, which is really good. And then um, there's just some important notice. It also came with um, the little booklet with all the different products that they had put out for it, and then um, the actual instruction manual, okay? So, and then it did come with like just this coil, that's it. Um, I got this for total with the shipping, I, I wanna say I got it for 50 bucks maybe? Um, I think that's how much I paid. So yeah, so I got this and then like I said, here's the case. The case is, see, they came in two different colors. They came in a really, really pretty, like turquoise green kind of color, which is the first version. And then they came in, in the version two, it was the pink or the white. Now, um, I wanted, like I said, I wanted the case to come with it. So I had no choice. I had to get the one in pink. I'm not a very big fan of pink, but I'll, Put up with it so anyways here's the case so you've got a lot of room um she included also this space bar which i have to look and see how to install it so when you put the space bar in you're able to cut the holes in a lot closer to the edge um but i went ahead and left that there so you've got all these pockets here 
There's another pocket over, well, there's something here. I guess you would probably put the tool case there. There's a pocket here, a pocket here. You've got pockets on the side for more tools there. And then there's a pocket on the front and a pocket on the back. So, um, yeah, I thought, hey, you know, like I said, it's a lot smaller than the cinch and I can bring this with me if I needed to. I don't know where I would bring it, but I can bring it with me. So, um, let's store all of it away. And it's padded on top of that. So, um, yeah, I was pretty happy and pleasantly surprised that it was not heavy as I thought it was going to be. So I purchased the bind it system. I mean, the, yeah, the binding system. And then um, two days later, I finally bit the bullet and went ahead and got some coils. Now, I also got this on Facebook Marketplace and this was a steal, okay? The girl was actually um, trying to sell it locally, but it had been sitting on there for weeks. And I went ahead and messaged her and asked her would she be willing to sell it to me and ship it. And she said yes. So I gave her my zip code. She went and found out how much the shipping would cost. So all in all, I got this whole box for like less than $22, something like that. And I don't know, I was, I don't know what I was thinking. I was thinking I wasn't gonna be getting that many, but then when I got the box, I was like, oh my God, I actually, I actually got really, really lucky for the amount of stuff that I got. So um, let's go ahead and see, actually here's the receipt, $23. I got all this for $23. So she had sent the instructional video, I mean, DVD. Um, I was so glad to see this because I didn't realize that it wasn't coming with the bind it system. Um, this one actually shows you the sizes of the coils. So that way, um, this was really helpful, in other words. Because if I'm thinking of making some smaller notebooks, so I actually needed to get these sizes. It's easier for me to visualize what sizes I need. Because I see a lot of people selling like the 3 fourths, the 1 inch, and then like the one fourth, but mostly like one inch. And that's like huge. I don't need to do notebooks that are like a hundred pages big. So this one right here is um, color red. And what I did was, cause it's not, it says it's a half, one half, two piece red. It doesn't even look like it's a half, hold on. Cause from what I've seen other people do, they take the coils and they, put it right up against this to measure it. Maybe it is. Yeah, it is. It's, um, it's one half, one half inch. Okay. So I got a one half inch red. Um, I've got a half inch antique silver, which does not look silver, but that's okay. Um, I've got, this is pink, one half inch pink one half inch black, one half inch silver, and this looks like a brush silver, antique silver, one half inch, six, yeah, black, actually they're called loops, it's kind of funny. Um, another half inch black, half inch black, and half inch black. So she originally got these at Hobby Lobby, as you can see, for $4.99. And there's six. So that's one, two. I'm gonna just keep them in the box because it's just easier for me to store away. Let's see, three, four, oops, five. And there's six. Seven, eight, eight times six, 48. That's a lot of coils, okay? And then that one goes in there and I think I'll store that one there. And that's my backup one. So yeah, this was a really, really good deal. Um, you know, like I said, I've been, tr I've been thinking about this and watching um, 
more the, the uh, Facebook Marketplace and also on Macari um, for just you know I was gonna try to get like the cheapest I could get the best deal and at some point there were a ton of like the machines and the coils up for grabs and then within about I'd say a month all of a sudden everybody's buying them and it's just really weird I don't know why all of a sudden everybody just decided to just jump into it so that's what kind of also pushed me to just go ahead and get it now while I could still get it so anyway so yeah that is my haul for the Zutter Bind It system. Um, I am going to still keep on watching some more videos to see, um, you know, just to make sure, I don't want to waste any of this stuff, in other words, because like I said, it's not being made anymore. I'm pretty sure I can buy these probably on Amazon or AliExpress. Um, the only thing is, is that what I've been seeing are not the two to one pitch, which is what these coils are. Um, everything I've been seeing is like three to one pitch. So yeah, I might have to resort to going on AliExpress. But anyways, um, I hope everyone's had a good week. And um, yeah, it's the weekend right now and I hope I can post this up soon. All right, have a good weekend. Bye-bye.